The only way we're going to do that is social distancing and treating the disease early. The but what is going, you treat, but, the better the outcome. But Dr. Egan, what is what the fuck is wrong with people? They're not social distancing. Uh, I know of a friend. Uh, the, uh, this woman is has been uh, diagnosed with uh, COVID nineteen, and she's walking around. She's saying, "I don't want to be bothered." I mean, what is it going to take to have true lockdown to get this thing under control? You know, this is a new era where you have to think about your community and not just yourself. His take home messages of all of this is that we're all in it with each other. If one person violates, it affects everybody. In China, the average spread from one person was to two and a half people. And then they spread to two and a half people each, and it keeps going and it explodes. Has China so got it under care control? of each other? Has China. China Oh, yeah, there haven't been cases this last uh, four or five days. There haven't been any cases in China. And that's I mean, because they did a full lockdown, right? Well, yeah, they've got a government that says you do this or else you go to jail. Um, right. You know, Korea, you know, if you're positive in Korea, all your neighbors get a text. Hey, Howard in apartment 3B is positive. And right. until you're out of quarantine, you've got a red circle around you and people know that you're positive. And they say, screw privacy for the greater good, which is the community taking care of each other. Yeah, because that's what I see going on. People who have it are like, hey, I don't want to be inconvenienced. And I and, you know, it's screw everybody else. That's sort of the attitude right that's now. That's the American way.